Hi, I'm Jennifer Edwards Milam with Reveal Event Style, and I'm going to be speaking about the combinations for your wedding bouquet. Choosing flower combinations for your wedding bouquet can be so much fun. Um, of course, inspiration is where it all begins with, and inspiration can be your bridal gown, nostalgia pieces um, from your, your mother, your grandmother, um, maybe what they carried in their bouquet. Sometimes that's a little relic of um, like a symbolic relic, um, maybe a cross, maybe a little Bible. Um, sometimes it could be a grandmother's brooch. Looking at um, magazines and books, such as um, flower magazines, of course, wedding magazines, but going a step forward and looking at your fashion magazines, because so much of this is reflected in floral design and artistry and shouldn't for any reason be overlooked because your gown probably is something pretty unique. and probably has one of these elements, such as the ruffles that are so big right now, and why wouldn't you want to incorporate that into your bouquet? It is your ultimate accessory for that day. One thing to think about when choosing flower combinations is to certainly not worry if it matches. Worry if you like it. If you like, um, let's say, a cymbidium orchid, but you also like, you know, a traditional rose or a dahlia or a gloriosa lily, put it together. It is so lovely and fun to see, see a bouquet that has different elements in it so that every time you look at it, you don't see the same thing and it kind of tells a story about you. You should always think about texture when you're considering your combinations of flowers because what makes one stand out from the other is the opposing textures of smoothness and roughly compared to maybe something very stark and rigid to something extremely fluffy and Flouncy. So putting um, sticks with hydrangea, you know, that couldn't be more opposite, but my goodness, it looks so beautiful together and really features both pieces, but brings them together um, with the entire look of your wedding. If that's something, a theme that's repeated, it can be so beautiful. Your floral professional will be able to guide you once you have your selected choices and on how to arrange them together to give them the most maximized look and to feature each flower so that not one ever powers the other one. They'll be able to um, help you arrange in the bouquet where things should go, again, so that nothing is overpowered and uh, even the direction to hold it and the way to hold it so that everything is noticed. And that's a good way to get started on selecting flower combinations for your wedding.